the end. Get started, stop show. Today, me and Cool Mom. Hi guys. Are gonna talk about my insect toys. Starting out with this ant. All right, now right here, the teeth are sharp. It's also big too. Very uh, has red eyes. It's scary, and it has like a two thin things here, and a fat abdomen. Abdomen. All right. So yeah, it's very cool, and also scary now. On top, it's a uh, pretty red, but underneath, it's just completely black. So yeah, it's very cool. All right. And the uh, uh, by the way, these are not the uh, legs; they're just antennas. Antennas. Is that a fire ant? Yeah. All right. Now the next insect is this bee. All right. Now. Instead of having a stripy bee, we have a spotted bee. Spot, spots, pretty much a lot of spots even on the tip of their legs, including the wings here. And yeah, it's pretty uh, spotty bee. Now, uh, bees are known for their honey and stinging. So yeah, they're very cool. And they pollinate flowers too, so yeah. Underneath, completely black. Alright. Now, we have, I have this giant bee right here with the stinger all right and the antenna too. and it's actually stripy this time it's a stripy bee also and also except for here it's just a uh, some uh brown part so yeah it also has translucent wings this time and some uh pretty cool looking lights at the big too and the uh, weird eyes and uh the antennas are shaking a bit. All right, so yeah, very cool. That's Sorry. a scary bee. It's a giant bee. Yeah, imagine if bees were this big. Mm -hmm. All right, also they have these uh, flap things here. Flap legs. Mm -hmm. All right, now the next one is this one now i don't know what beetle this is i'm not really so sure but anyway i'll just call it an apple beetle because it's colored like an apple so yeah and also this part's not really colored like an apple but anyway so yeah it also has these mandibles too and some more antennas and shiny eyes the entire black thing's eyes by the way so yeah it's very cool and there's like this uh, triangle thing here so yeah and underneath there's some uh, brown for the legs. And it's completely yellow. Alright. Oh, I think that's a cockroach. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's not really. <laughs> Alright. Now, we have this giant spider ornament thing. Alright, now, it has like these uh, purple dots, three purple dots. Ooh. These are uh, one bronze dot colored like a nickel or a penny. And. There's a white one or silver one here. One, one. And has this uh, mandibles, which are sort of looks like a mustache a bit. And not so sharp. So yeah, it also has some uh, yellow, black eyes too. Golden and black eyes. So yeah, and has four legs. This one, this leg right here, I don't know why, but it's like small. So yeah, it's very cool. And translucent abdomen and it's also uh also looks like a uh, ball so you could uh, put a chip there <laughs> i think this is glass yeah yeah that is glass actually all right now the next insect i'm going to talk about is a bigger ant an even bigger ant now instead of just a uh, being like this flat like straight it is curving up then just stays there all right and has big mandibles imagine if ants were this big that would be scary mm -hmm. all right so yeah it's very cool it's also uh the no antennas all right so yeah it's also uh maybe the common ones that we normally see normal that you guys can see so yeah and also these bugs have a lot of these claw things all right Kian, i think that's a uh Queen ant. Mm, yeah. All right. Now the next. Oh, actually no. I think our queen ants have big tummies. Maybe. Oh. Abdomen. Okay. All right. 
So this is a giant spider. Now it has four legs. I mean eight legs. Four on each side. And yeah, it also has on the tip it's like spikes, but they don't actually have those two legs. So whew, all right. And has some two red eyes. So scary. And fans too. So So, uh, the next one is another spider, but this one's like Black Widow. Oh, that's a Black Widow. Alright. Now, um, very cool. On top, it's blank. But I'm, I think, aren't they, like, supposed to have the, this the red thing light, like... here? Eh, it's still very cool looking, though. So, yeah, it's also made up of uh, rubber, too. Maybe it's bouncy. Yeah. It's bouncy. Yep, it's bouncy. Alright, and also has a big abdomen. Much small body. So, yeah. Alright, now, the next insect is this stag beetle or Darwin's beetle. It's uh, many species of these guys. Now, keep in mind, this is not the mouth. It's just pinchers near the mouth. The mouth is like in the middle. So, yeah, and also. It's like very spiky too on the legs. And there's these two horn looking things too. Sort of like gaps. So yeah, very cool looking. Alright. The next insect is this rhino beetle. Oh, now, that's cool. Now you might think. Well, when I was a lot younger, I used to think that this was the mouth in the middle, but no, the mouth is down mm -hmm. here. And it may have, it actually moves its head up like this. That's the spike on top is right here. The horns are down. So, so yeah, it's also very big too. Which it has like some small tiny dots. And spiky legs too. But yeah, it's very cool. And it looks like it's in a helmet shell. Alright, now this, speaking of bees. This is a wasp. Now wasp, they're not really bees, they just uh they fight bees. So yeah. And the ones are like thinner and it itself itself is thinner. So yeah. And has a uh, not so uh, stripy pattern. Yeah. It's like some weird pattern. So yeah, there you go, right? Yeah. Yeah, and also has some thin legs. So it's like a thinner version of a bee. Mm -hmm. Not like this. And this it's a wind-up caterpillar. Oh my gosh. So maybe if we have this. Oh. I think it's... Yeah. I, I think, think it's rusty. Yeah. No. <laughs> I think it's broken. Oh. Oh. You need to, you need to tap it. Tap, tap, tap. Okay, it's just stuck. Oh, see? Oh. You need to tap. Let me do this. Oh! Oh, no. Okay, I think it's broke. But anyway, here's a caterpillar toy, which uh, used to uh, move. I had this one out a lot younger. And it was actually more fluently moving before. But now it's like a... It doesn't really move so much. Maybe this will work. Alright. So yeah, and there's also like these uh this mouth looking thing on the back, which makes it look like these are eyes. So yeah, it's very cool. And he's smiling too. <laughs> Alright. So cute. Yeah. Now the next one is a less cuter one. Or less cute one. It's oh, this. A scorpion. A now, this is the actual size of a scorpion. Oh yeah? Really? Well, a lot of them. That big? Okay, uh, maybe the king scorpion or the emperor scorpion. But anyway, so they're very dangerous. Not because of this, but it's because of this. This stinger, which packs a painful amount of venom. So you can't just. Oh no. It will, uh. Or just do this. Oh. It will, uh, inject some venom in you and you will. 
paralyzed? Yeah, yeah. no, you'll die. Oh, you die? Yeah, you'll just die. I thought you anyway. were just gonna be paralyzed. Now, this guy, he has these uh, pinchers, so it's sort of like a lobster. Sort yeah. Of, yeah. And You're it's right. like eight legs. So, yeah, it's also very scary. Now, the eyes aren't here. It's these two little white things here in the middle. So, yeah, very cool and scary. So, it's scory. Scory? Scory. It's scory. Yeah, scory. Scory. So, yeah. All right, now the next one is the centipede. Now, the centipede, it's like a. They also have venom. If they bite you, you're not dying. You you will. Are you? Yeah, you you just you'll die. Anyway, now it has like a million legs. On um, uh, there's also a, a species called a millipede, which isn't venomous, but you're not really sure if it's a centipede or a millipede. Anyway, so yeah, it's very cool. It also has like these uh, two antennas on the back, which make it look like that's the head. So that if it gets bitten there, it won't die immediately. So yeah, it's also very scary too. And orange. Alright. Now the next bug is... That bug. It has really no name. But anyway, I'll call it like a bear bug. Because it's sort of shaped like a bear. Anyway, so it has some uh, green stripes. And some uh, legs that are slightly lo look like wind-ups. But they're not. So yeah. And some uh, holes here, gaps, and some black beady eyes, so you can uh, scare your friend with this. Oh. Alright, so yeah, now the next ones are these two guys, and these two guys. Now, this is very cool because these are both ant toys, by the way, and one of them is blue and red, so we have like opposite ant toys, so... Cool color. You want to be blue or red? I want to be Two, one, fight! Alright, here's how you play the game. You have to block the other player okay. for them to go that side. Okay. If they go that side, then you, okay. then you, you lose. So yeah, 3, 2, 1. 3, three 2, 1, go! <laughs> oh, you win. You went there first. Alright, so yeah, they're very cool. They're like um, opposites now. Like um, yin and yang. Uh, lava and water. So yeah, yeah it's very water. cool. And we have some baby eyes too. And instead of these pinchers being the mouth, the mouth is down here. Down here. Not. So yeah, it's very cool. <laughs> Alright. So the next one is this ladybug. Oh, I love that. Yeah, ladybugs are uh, like, they're actually beetles and uh, sometimes when I was a lot younger, the two white spots here I used to think those were eyes, but the eyes were down here. So yeah, it's very cool. And that's a lot of uh, spots, black spots. And this one is smiling. So yeah. And underneath, blank, red. It looks cute. Yeah, it looks cute. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so yeah. Now the next insect toy is... What's that? Oh, oh no, caterpillar. It. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. A grasshopper. Yeah, a grasshopper. Now, grasshoppers are called grasshoppers because they hop. Yeah, they hop. They uh, jump. Hop, and they hop, also hop. stay in the grass and they eat the grass too. Oh. So this was a cartoonish version. The real life version looks like this. Mm -hmm. A bit weirder, scarier, cooler actually. So yeah. Alright, now this cartoon version. Has uh, no sharp legs. The two finger things. Here too. But anyway, it's still very cool though. He has some uh, big eyes and he's smiling down here. So yeah, it's also thin. Alright. It's also a brighter color. Now the next one is uh, a different type of rhino beetle, which has like a Baby flat. Uh, maybe. Alright, so I'll talk about this one first. The chocolate milk one. <laughs> I call it the chocolate milk. Alright, now he's completely brown with some uh, horn here, rhino horn, flap mouth, which is actually down here. 
And yeah, it's pretty cool. It's also fat too. So. Alright, now this pink one, which is uh, the actual rhino beetle, oh. is. You know, it's, it's pretty cool. Looking. So yeah, very cool. And it's also. Has like a cherry strawberry color to it. So yeah. And also has the horn thing. So. Okay. Alright. Now this beetle, I'm not really sure what it is. I don't really know. Maybe it's like a different. Maybe, Maybe these yeah. are the same things. Alright. So yeah, it's very cool. And the antennas on the tip are flat. Like hands doing this. So. Clap your hands. So yeah, very cool. And has the clock things. And it's also like red. Now the next beetle is the stag beetle, a brown one that's army green colored, and has pinchers. And the real mouth is like a pincher down bug? here. Yeah, we, oh, yeah, yeah, you can call it pincher bug. So yeah, it's very cool. Okay. All right. Oh, and also underneath is orange. Oh. Ah, there. All right. Now the next beetle is. This beetle now. Yet again, I'm not really sure what it is. Has this like a mouth down here. Has this cool pattern, like a shield shape. It's flat. And has some um, nose. First, our insect with the nose here. Oh, let me see. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so that's yeah, very cool. And has six legs. And underneath, completely blue. So yeah, so I like this. Now, here's some more grasshoppers, but with legs in a different position this time and there's some more opposite so so we can have a four player dodge it but so like uh rainbow colors all right let me uh let me right. fix it by color Here's the color all right there. So yeah, it's very cool. They're like candy bugs. Yeah. So candy bugs now. This rhino beetle is not the real thing. It's like just a um a cool looking version, like a robot version. Now this rhino beetle has horns, three of them, and has an iron head, and some green eyes, and has spiky legs. Oh and also there's some more legs here, but yeah, it's very cool. So yeah. Now, it also has a fuzzy wind, wing shield. So yeah. Now this bug is a stink bug. Now, as the name suggests, they stink. So they're actually like a, they're really like pests in some countries. And there's a lot of them that would really suck. So you just have to get a spray and... What do you mean if you touch it? You can smell it, it's stinky? Yeah, or you just... Okay. Or if you just touch it and then... So yeah, very cool. It's also green red eyes. Alright, now the next bug here is... This mantis. Now, this mantis bug... Oh, I also have a smaller one and... This uh, fatter one. <laughs> so anyway, now the smaller one, it's pretty normal. Except it had like red eyes. And yeah, it's pretty cool. Now, this mantis here, it's like four legs. It's like maybe it's like uh there used to be something underneath, but then this uh, body went on top. So yeah, it's very cool. It's okay. Oh, and it also have like these uh slicer things. So um yeah. Now this mantis is a fat one and also has the uh these um folded pinchers or slicer thing so yeah very cool it's also yellow and green all right now this is a butterfly oh, so yeah. yeah it's very cool and also has this uh it's called Maybe a monarch the, butterfly the butterfly that are Moths? So big like a mariposa. Uh, mariposa. There's the Atlas moth. It's actually a moth, actually. So yeah, 
Very cool. And uh, by the way, if you see a butterfly like this, well, you know it's a butterfly, but if they're like this sometimes, then it's either a moth or just a butterfly. How do, you, how do you... Well, it's the looks. The black, bigger, beady eyes. It's gray, not so colorful. So yeah, this is also a um, cool yellow. Okay. And has the uh, nectar sucker thing. Okay. Alright, now, this beetle... I forgot the name, but it's like a blue beetle, which I'll I... call it a gloom beetle, like glowing mushroom thing that glows. So yeah, it's very cool. It also has like these two stripes, and one of them is not really much of a stripe, and has these two mandibles. And yeah, very cool. And underneath, completely blue. Mm -hmm. Now, this is a giant stink bug. Now, just imagine bigger stinks. <gasps> oh. That so, would really not be so, good. Yeah. All right. So yeah, but it's still very cool looking. You know, which has a brown and yellow color. Sort of looks like a leaf, and on the side are some red spots. So yeah. And some long antennas too. Antennae. Okay. Now here's something that you've met, seen many times. Okay. These, yeah, we don't like these ones. <laughs> Oh, 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 no, oh, no. It's a giant fly. Huh, huh. Get the spider. <laughs> so yeah, we have a. I have a giant uh, fly toy, and you've already seen them. Now this doesn't have the grid eyes, which would have been a cool thing. So yeah, it also has these wings, and they are very dirty. So yeah, it's also okay. green on this. All right now, the next one is this bug, which this beetle. I'm not sure what it is this time. It's like shaped like a it's cockroach. Like... I think this is a cockroach. So this yellow cockroach. Keep in mind, uh, not all these are accurate. Playing. It's still very cool though. Different colors now. This cockroach is yellow now. You've seen them too. They're like other pests, which are dirty. Sort of like flies. Maybe so they're like a wild cockroach. <laughs> <laughs> that would be uh, pretty cool though. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, it's cool and has some long tentacles. Some pinchers, mandibles. Now, the next one is tarantula. Now, tarantulas, you won't find them in your house. Glad you do it. But they're like very furry and bigger than normal spiders, like daddy long legs, anyway. And this one also has like eight eyes and also has some eight legs. These aren't legs, they're actually like a feeler things. And the teeth are here. This actually looks pretty realistic. So yeah, very cool. It's like a Halloween color. I mean, there are some Halloween All right, spiders. So yeah, now this, I don't really know anymore what this bug is. Oh, I also have this spider too, which is a plastic spider. So yeah, very cool. Now this flat one is has some yellow eyes, long antennas. This thing on the butt. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I'm actually not sure what it is. I thought it's it has long legs. Or... It doesn't really have wings. So... Oh yeah. Maybe it's like a nymph of uh, some nymph. Um, some like baby bugs. Some uh, some beetles, possibly all beetles, mm -hmm. come from larvas and nymphs. Or like dragonflies or nymphs. So yeah, and also mantis. <laughs> I'm actually not sure. All right, now this. I mean, I'm not sure about the mantis. All right, now this. It's a gem beetle. Now it's silver and green. And uh, I used to catch some real gem beetles, which were like uh, mango colored, the green mangoes. So yeah, it's very cool. And it's also made by a company that made this. So yeah. This one is a, a butterfly. butterfly. Yeah, or just a smaller butterfly. So there are some butterflies bigger than the others, so it wouldn't really be a baby. So yeah, but it's still very cool though. And uh, I uh, I don't really get that much butterflies. I I get like mo small moths, this small. Oh, yeah. Alright, so anyway. So yeah, it also has these antennas and the tongue. Yeah. And some cool pattern. So um, yeah, these were my uh, insect toys with a uh, Puma.
So yeah, make sure to subscribe and uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, click the notification bell. <laughs> yeah. So um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is TN's Kids Voice Talk Show, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe and check out my other videos.